Rike is the best platform for checking out reports and quickly visualizing your work. This video is brought to you by Software Horsepower. For checking the report, one just needs to click on the space. Here, just go to the tool and click on the plus button. And one can see the option of report. To get started, it is very simple. The first step is to create a new report, then just click and define the name of the report. The next level is to decide the details to include. One can include from the various options, such as a custom report of a project or any overdue task, and subtask by assigning weekly project reports or due task reports, or time spent this week, when the project is due this month's report. Let's click on the custom report. Here, the next level is to define the project in our folder space. So one can work with multiple projects or folders just by clicking on the plus button. One can work with multiple folders by selecting the next folder based on the project and task or subtask. The third step is to apply the filter to refine the report. One can filter any system report like the owner. From the drop down, one can select the two owners also. The starting date, finish date can be selected and reports can be checked for today and final report for the month. And here one can work with multiple filters. The final step is to define the layout or format of the final output. One can select the column as well as the table. Here, let's first check out the column. After that, one can work with the table. So now the report is ready to save and run. One can add it to the report by clicking on the add button and work with tasks and subtasks. So the report is grouped by the assigned status. If one wants to check out only active reports, just click on the active tab and only active reports will be shown here. And if one wants to check out all the reports once more, just click on the tab again. One can see more options by clicking on the three dots in the right corner. And in the right corner, one can see more options and choose from the option like flip the axis or side by side view and can check out the multiple forms. With more actions, one can define and check out the snapshot. If one wants to send a snapshot to the client or colleague or teammate or manager, just use the snapshot create and send it by email or can check out a duplicate of this report. To check out the table report, one needs to click on the add and then click on the desks and save it. Here is how the table report looks like. One can add and remove the column by clicking on the gear tab. Here, one can check the tabs required and uncheck the non-required ones, like item type and plan fees and plan cost. If one wants to work with a completed date, just click on the completed date so it can be added to the report. One can subscribe to the report on a weekly basis. If one wants to check out any report on Monday, select a time, subscribe and an updated report will be saved on a weekly basis. One can subscribe and select multiple days also in a week and get the update. So an updated report will be shown on the data for a particular day. This is how one can create a report in Reich. Contact Software Horsepower for free demo and best offers. Visit softwarehorsepower.com.